All right, it's officially a wrap for Joel Embiid's regular season as he's set to sit out against the Hawks on Friday, and I don't see why he would play against Brooklyn in the season finale as the Sixers are locked into the third seed, making the game meaningless from their perspective. Embiid had one last big splash in his ridiculous season, however, dropping 52 points in the win on the Boston Celtics, a team they're likely to face in the second round of playoffs. Embiid will finish with a league-high 33.3 points per game, the highest in the NBA since James Harden's MVP season, and this will be his second consecutive year leading the NBA in scoring. The MVP race was tightly contested between the same trio as last season, Embiid, Jokic, and Giannis a little further back, but Embiid's 52-point game in a crucial matchup may be the nail in the coffin, as a Nuggets lackluster finish to the year is not helping Jokic, neither is him sitting out the last several games. It would be a very well-deserved award for Embiid, who was robbed of an all-star starting spot earlier in the season, and it's about time he earns the respect he deserves from the league. The only thing he's missing is a deep playoff run. As we all know, you will get discounted in this league if you don't show up in playoffs. With the Bucks and Celtics in their way of reaching the NBA Finals, it will be a difficult run to the finish, but the Sixers have the talent to make a run, and they can trust Embiid will make his presence known, as he has all season.